tonight. Basically, and also thank anybody who's done anything, large or small, whether you've written letters, made donations, or knocked on doors. We've been supportive of making change happen in America, in Illinois, and in Chicago. That's what we're all about. Um, we don't have a very fancy agenda for tonight except for neighbors to get together and neighbor. And I will I'd start off with, if I just introduced, yeah, neighbor's a new verb, I invented it. Neighbors get together to neighbor. So please introduce, let's go around and say hello. Yes. Tell us, my name's Michael Harrington, I'm right here in Rogers Park. So going right there, start. Uh, John Burke, treasurer and acting chairman of the Carolyn Hedger Tenant Advisory Committee. Okay. Uh, my name's Carl Waters and I live in the 1020 West Thorndale. Okay. Bill Morton, president of the Rogers Park Chamber of Commerce, running for 49th Ward. Alderman, lift the band. Oh. Okay. Uh, I'm uh, Trudy Leung. I'm a student at Northeastern Illinois University. Uh, currently, the uh, a member on the Illinois Board of Higher Education Student Advisory Committee, and I'm a member, not a member, but I'm, I help a lot at the chamber. I interned there, and I'm Bill's assistant and his campaign that, manager. That's a long list, <laughs> sir. Uh, Eric Tice, I'm Edgewater. Thank you, sir. Jim DeRue, I'm Rogers Park. Thank you. Talika Howard, Rogers Park. Thank you. Carmen Taylor, Rogers Park. Kathleen yeah, Rogers Park. Austin, a 32 year resident of Rogers Park, and a strong supporter of Maria Hayden, who's running for <laughs> So we're just introducing ourselves. You're not asking us, you know, like how we feel. That's right. that, you take that over. What's your name, okay. Katie? All right, I'm Katie, and I'm from here. And uh, yeah, I, I'm sorry for calling you all together the night after election night. I'm as much as happy as <laughs> We can, we can sound it together. Keep going around. Yes, okay. Tom. Tom Clark. Cookie Brian. Rogers Park. Tom Clark. Mason Garcia, Rogers Park. Nick Hawes, Rogers Park. Maureen Hickey on the very edge of the 49th on the ridge, but on the good side of the ridge. <laughs> 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 Boy, I'm fighting 49th. I'm oh, a strong yeah. race supporter. Natalia Bear, Rogers Park. Maria Hatton, Rogers Park. Woo! Chris Johnson, Rogers Park. <coughs> Brown Linnelkis, Rogers Park, and longtime member of Network 49. Woo! Thank you all. Yeah. I think we had some ideas of what we should be chit chatting about. Well, originally, um, you know, originally we didn't know what this day was going to feel like. We didn't know if we'd be happy or sad. We still don't know. <laughs> so there's, there's, uh, there. It was basically uh, to give ourselves a moment to breathe and uh, and come together and share our wisdom about what happened yesterday, what we thought happened, what we thought we needed to have happened that didn't, and also then to sort of consciously go, okay, now it's time to turn inward to the municipals, which in our case involves an aldermanic race right here in the what board and of course the big mayor and all the other municipal offices up to begin that conversation. Uh, for many, it, that began months ago, I know that. <laughs> I was doing this other election. Uh, so I'll catch up with y'all now. Um, so I don't know, I don't know what to say other than what is the best news that you got yesterday? Right, right. go on. Yes, well, I think, and I think Katie will agree with you. We were both doing the same thing with different groups, but the fact that Illinois moved so strongly, including the 6th and 14th districts, and then we've got two great people going to Congress, to the House of Representatives, we did that, and I don't know, I don't know if other people saw that, there's an article in Mother Jones about yes, that's a great article. how Chicago is uniquely positioned to help these types of races in these surrounding districts and counties, because people like Peter Roscoe and Catherine are just an hour away, and we had, I was caravanning out from Evanston, and you were caravanning out from Edgewater, I haven't been home on a Sunday in four weeks, five weeks. I don't know how many Sundays. You haven't been home on a weekend in like, I don't know. I, I'm not telling. I'm yeah, just not telling. But okay. it worked. And it was, for me, my first real experience of the, everybody here who's been around a lot has done this new leather a lot more than me. This is, this is my experience of how like, the face-to-face -face format does it. 
starting like, I don't know, almost eight, eight months ago. Yeah, yes. like that. And help with the signatures and the, uh, and then the collection itself. And there was a group of about five of us. I mean, there were a lot of people. Like, I don't know, the little group I was with was about five people we met every weekend. And um, then we were up there for the last three days. And how do you do it, Chris? We lost. Yeah. But by what? <laughs> yeah, it, he did not win. But his campaign, I thought, was awesome. It was well organized. It, there were a lot of people uh, from volunteering from my team at like an hour away, or from right here, lots of people from right there in Racine and Kenosha. And I believe very strongly that we helped elect Tony Evers. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay.